Are we ready to get a little uh, EBGB? Are we ready to get a little EBGB? I think it's about that time, all right? It's about that time. We hung out a little bit. We talked. We got naked at some point. That's why you got to show up to the streams. If you're watching this on YouTube and you don't show up to the streams and you want to see me naked, I might be there. Anyways, um, we got Scary Comp V88. Here we are. Chat, back me up, right? We, we got naked. Let me get ones in the chat if we got naked today. But yeah, we got Scary Comp V88. Okay, we've been waiting for this one a long time. Okay, we've been waiting a little bit. Guys, should I go lights off? I think I go lights off, to be honest. I think those are the vibes lately. I think we'd like to get a little extra creepy. Okay, I don't know what that sound was. I think we go a little extra creepy, bro. Um, okay. I think this is good. This is good. Okay, as you can see, Scary Comp V88. We're about to dive in. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I will see you on the other side. Good luck. <clears throat> on October 10th of 2020. Ooh, make it red. Ooh, okay. Let, wait, let's make it red in here. I kind of like that. Can I even... How does red look? Ooh, okay, wait. Oh, wait. Wait. Wait on it. Oh, yeah. Oh, 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 Whoa. Damn. You kind of make me feel some type of way with his lighting, dude. I feel like some crazy shit's about to go down. Shit. All right. 23. A toy camera captures footage of a girl playing with her toys and talking about her day. The entire video is nothing more than just a miniature vlog, as all she does is talk about her day and what she plans on doing with her friends in the following week. Okay. But there's something about this video that has left the girl's family deeply unsettled. Okay, is it this fucking creepy ass doll that looks like Woody from Toy Story had a seizure? Is it that one? You're messing around with my little sister's camera. It's weird. It's weird. <laughs> okay, uh, I'm just gonna show it to you. Just, okay. It goes without saying, but the video is pretty creepy. The following is the full video from the toy camera posted right. by the older sister. Take a look. Hey guys, today I'm going to show you my Skibbity Toilet Collection that I just got today. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. This is filmed last year, 2023. What is a Skibbity Toilet Collection? And why is it recorded on this in 2023? Um, we went to a toy store and they had all of these things like this cameraman, these tiny little action figures, this big scary toilet, and this one. And then we actually found these scary toilet shoes. And they say scary Skibbity toilet, toilet shoes? <laughs> what? A lot of kids at my school like scary toilet. Um, I saw my friend the other day, and we went on a walk, and we also got ice cream that day, and I'm having a lot of What are you looking at, bro? What you looking at like that? I don't even see what happened. Wait, what what happened, bro? What starts off as an innocent video turns into something completely different. Midway through the footage, something catches her attention. But after seeing whatever it was, she's immediately put on edge. It's as if she was paralyzed with fear. But thankfully, she was able to leave before things got a whole lot creepy. Only a few minutes later, we see this. 
A dark figure passes in front of the tent. What the fuck? It's hard to make out what this was, but her older sister is certain that this is what her sibling had seen. Now it's unknown if she's asked her about what she saw, as the only information on this video is the context she gave. But until there's an update, we won't know for sure what was there. So until then, okay. you be the judge on what was captured. Interesting. Um, In this next video... <laughs> Holy Granny Jenkins. You know what's weird about um a lot of the fucking videos we've seen recently? Why do the ghosts move so fast, bro? Video, a grandmother is celebrating her birthday while being surrounded by friends and family, all of whom are singing happy birthday to her. Happy birthday to you. As the video plays out, it seems that this footage is nothing more than just a normal video of someone recording their grandma, or at least it seems like that. Okay. Because, as you continue to watch, something happens that makes this video the stuff of nightmares. This is what was caught. What the fuck? As everyone collectively sings, a shadow-like figure bolts behind the grandma. That, yo, that actually looked really weird because it looked like it ran by and then went down. <laughs> Wait, that was weird, bro. And that's just what we were talking about, dude. They move so fast, how? Mom, in a swift motion, the figure is gone. It rushes over at full speed. But how is not it so happening fast like that? that we can't dude? discern what this was. As viewers have noted, it kind of looks like a child, or a girl to be exact, who's running at an inhuman speed. Perhaps it was running so fast that no one had noticed it except the camera. Now this video becomes a whole lot creepier when reading the description it came with. As it states, the grandmother in this footage had a daughter who unfortunately passed away many years ago. Oh, when she was alive, she would often run around the house while playing with her older sibling. It's for this reason that she believes that this was her spirit. But as always, you be the judge on what was wait, captured. Wait, 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 okay. He just said the grandma had a daughter not too long, that died not too long ago. Why, wait, wouldn't that make her like fucking 50 years old running around the house? Why she run around the house at 50, bro? Unless she had the, oh, granddaughter. Something ain't adding up. Was a ghost caught on camera, or had something else been caught? You run around your house? Yeah, I'm not. I'm not 50. Come on, Chet. It's late at night when a man gets something on camera that leaves him extremely unsettled. The man recording this is known as Drosa, and on this night, he was looking after his little niece and nephew. He was taking care of them all by himself when his niece began to point at something in the dark. Droza, their uncle, didn't think much of it until he noticed that she wouldn't stop pointing at the spot. Nothing appeared to be there, what? so Droza wasn't sure as to what she was seeing. Oh, but as she kept nah. on pointing, he began to think that maybe something is actually there. Feeling immensely unnerved, he records this video. Then this door is wide open over here, man. Dude, stop, was... stop, 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 stop. What? She's like looking over there like there's someone over there. She's freaking me out. <laughs> Look, she's pointing. See? There's someone over there. What? Who are you pointing at? Who is he? I can make you point. Where's he at? Is he over there? How do you how do you fake this with the kid though? I'm not really sure who it is, but yeah, she's like point upwards. They must be tall or something. Like you can't, you can't teach a little baby Look, that age to again. Look. His niece would not stop pointing at this spot for some reason. Even creepier is that she points towards the ceiling, suggesting that whatever is there is most likely tall. Oh, but hell as if nah. things couldn't get any more creepy, Drosa records this. Yeah, she said something though. Like it's crazy because like, I know I'm just babysitting my niece and nephew. My nephew's right here. Then it's her and then she keeps pointing at something. Nah, dude, how'd you not freak out, you know?
How did you not freak out, bro? You gotta get out of here, man. You gotta leave, man. <laughs> Honestly. You're not welcomed here. Leave. Dude, he's Where? talking to the ghost like the ghost is gonna come up and be like, yo, you know what? All right, my boy. I'm out this bitch. Like, where you are, leave. You ain't just gonna dap the ghost up, bro. Niece. Look, she keeps pointing at you. Get the f out of here, man. Just when things were getting tense, this happens. An object unexpectedly falls towards Droza and his niece. It's almost as though something had thrown it. Caught off guard, Droza is left speechless, but only to a certain point because later he vents his frustration with whatever it was that was messing with him and his niece. Huh. You gotta get out of here, man. You gotta leave, man. <laughs> he then stops recording and decides to ignore yeah, it. Yeah, you know what, you right. Despite everything, he still, to this day, has no idea as to what his niece was seeing at this hallway. Okay, interesting. All right, number five. What we got, what we got, what we got. Not bad so far. At approximately 3 p.m., a mother grabs her phone to record something highly unusual that just happened. Okay. This odd occurrence had taken place around the back entrance of the house. She films this video, hoping that it happens again, but only this time on camera. The only other time she's recorded this door was when one of her dogs had cracked the glass on the window pane. <laughs> Although initially extremely upset, she now looks back at this memory with great nostalgia, as recently her dog was put to sleep. Oh. But fast forward to this exact day, and she's once no, again No, I need RIPs in the chat, bro. Suddenly, no, not the happens. puppy. Even when it's open, it's like that. Oh. Any RIPs, bro? Can you move? Oh, pup. He's coming back. What? 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 Oh, whoa. Nah, dude, I'm gonna cry. Can you I'm gonna cry, bro. No. 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 No! No! Oh my God, bro. Dude. The puppy just wants to be let in the house, but, but the puppy's dead and he doesn't probably doesn't know. And... <laughs> God, puppy been waiting all day too. Just waiting all day to be let in. I hate how he plays this like kind of sad music too, bro. <laughs> I'm too drunk for this, Sophia. You're drunk right now on a Monday? He's going to play with the dog. And then it's going to come back. No. Carter Will said no. Silhouette of a dog can be seen on the glass. No, it bro. appears out of nowhere and stays in place as though waiting to be let inside. But it's only there momentarily before seemingly fading away. The family no doubt believes that this was the spirit of their belated dog who was sadly put down. Aww. Although deeply saddened, they're happy to know that their presence is still here. Ghost or not, Wait, this he footage presents? reassures them that even if they had no choice but no. to put them down, their beloved pet will always be there. Everybody no go hug what. your dog right now, bro. Please go hug your dog. God, man, I hate dog shit. Dog shit makes me so sad, bro. In the following video, a group of friends are playing with a toy known as Simon. Okay. When out of nowhere, things take a very Ooh, creepy turn. Oh, little Simon says. Now it's worth noting this toy only has one function, which is to generate a pattern of lights and sounds okay. for the player to memorize and win the game. Did anybody ever own one of these? Okay, so Yo, you know what this reminds me of? It was like the this, and then there was the bop it shit. Bop it, twist it, pull it, yeah, fuck me, right? And then once you get to the final stage, he says, fuck me. And you got to like, all right, never mind. It's a simple game of short-term memory skill. However, in this video, it appears that the toy was acting beyond its intended purpose. Rather than generating patterns, it was answering questions. Wait, what? Okay, okay, I'll go, I'll go. Okay, is my shirt black? Dude, oh, dude, it's, this thing is possessed, man. Wait, this thing is possessed. wait, uh, wait. No. Am I a girl? <laughs> oh, okay, hold on. How can they fake this? That's a crazy thing, bro. Wait, what? 
yo chat how about this if we ever do an irl ghost hunting thing we get one of these bro that's such a good idea tommy write it down tommy write it down write it down write it down write it down we get one of these we do the ghost thing now the video was taken at a house party the where hell is that? friends gathered in the hostess little sister's bedroom the young sister was away from home they had grown bored of the party downstairs so they hung out here with all the toys and games dude that's like a but movie no that staying up here was a big mistake Wait, why? This is their video. Dude, it was acting up earlier. Yeah, it's crazy. So you guys can't be in here. I was there with all day. Really? Hanging out. The fuck? This thing is possessed, man. This thing is possessed. All right, okay. Uh, ask me a question. Ask me a question. What color is the sky? <laughs> Wait. Uh, yeah. I guess I need to ask yes or no. Is the sky blue? <laughs> no! <laughs> Dude, come, get, come ask a question. Dude, this seems like a movie, Dude, does it not? Ask it a question, dude. Like, ask it a question, dude. All of a sudden, the guy in the corner is like... They're like, dude, what's wrong with David? And he's in the corner. You know what I'm saying? It's kind of exhilarating. Dude. Yeah. Am I black? Oh! <laughs> Am I black? Oh! <laughs> oh it's dude. Oh, that's oh, it no. It knows, dude. <laughs> uh, that's good, no. Am I a girl? All right, we already saw that, though. <laughs> What's the next part? Oh! Okay, so it shit. knows. Dude, it knows, dude. So this it thing's, knows. This thing's, it's like uh, one of those Ouija boards, yeah. dude. Yeah. It knows. Oh. My mom played before. Have you gotten that some more moves? Oh, dude, let, the picture, dude. The picture. Oh. She's your dad. <laughs> all right, come on, bro. You checking all the boxes? Oh, you got you got the creepy kids toy that somehow answers. You got the shitty acting. You got the kid in the corner. And then you got the fucking drawing from the little kid. Dude. Dude, this will actually like tell. Okay. Are you with us in this room? <laughs> Dude, alright. Oh, Dude, no. This, this is gonna be Wait, loud as fuck, bro. Oh! Oh! oh my gosh, that's so creepy. That is so creepy dude dude the yeah, acting's so like bad bro dude, it's just no floor, man. <laughs> dude, i'm like actually kind of scared dude yeah. um, dude, like what even is that like that okay okay all right well let's let's get real crazy i'm leaving you guys hear it from there it came from right here yeah Dude, stop at a window, bro. The fuck we doing on a window? Oh, okay, all right. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay. All right, fine. That's enough. That's enough. Feeling totally creeped out, the group hurries out of the room, leaving everything behind. The tap on the window convinced them that something strange was indeed happening. According to them, it didn't make sense that someone was outside tapping Dude, on the that's, window. That's so crazy, Faye. <laughs> hey, honestly, you know what? That's a good concept, though. I like the Simon Says thing. That was kind of that was kind of creative, I guess. Dude, a demon taps on the window. Whoa, no, let's get out of the room now. Like, all right, bro. Considering that they were on the second floor, Whoa! there was also no balcony. If no one had been outside, then who or even what was at the window? Really, While coffee. The group has yet to come up with an answer. They can't help but think that the figure in the picture had something to do with this. That's so funny, Viewers bro. believe the toy was being used as a conduit. Yeah, we don't. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It was recorded. This next video was recorded by a father who swears. Okay, on this day, May May twentieth, twenty. All right, so it's last year as well. May 20, 2023, from our nanny cam. Unexplainable was captured on his baby monitor. It was on December 20th of 2023 when this incident took place. Around 9 p.m., he and his wife were having playtime with their two kids before going to bed. They usually play games such as tag or hide and seek. 
But unlike other times, something happens that to this Nanny day can. the father can't explain. He records the footage of this incident on his phone. Take a look. Do you guys keep your baby powder on the uh, on the nightstand too? That's what I do. I keep it right next to my milk. Chad, I gotta pee so bad after this, bro. Yo, I gotta pee. <gasps> oh. The fuck? I gotta pee so bad. Waiting for a response. Fuck, bro. What was that sound? Dude, why did I think that was a ghost lady, bro? Yo, why did I think that was a ghost lady? Oh my god. Oh, I freaked out for a second. I was like, behind you, bro. <laughs> <laughs> you are a lady behind you. I know, but we're downstairs. Okay. Oh, I'm this is stressing you. You're stressed out. What? You might even change my diaper. Oh, <laughs> my God. Thinking that his wife or kid was hiding in the closet, he waits for them to come out. But unbeknownst to him, no one was inside. Understandably, the father was totally freaked out. That's so weird. He swears that right before the door opened, he heard a voice. Was that not his wife? Looking back at this clip, he can finally rest assured that he wasn't just hearing things, but rather having actually heard something. Despite having no explanation for this odd occurrence, the family has been getting comments from those who believe that something supernatural had occurred. Interesting. But regardless of what this could have been, the family is adamant on keeping the- Okay, interesting, interesting. Guys, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna leave you with the scary heebie-jeebie. Are you guys gonna be okay? I'm gonna go pee real quick, do the quick- All right, Mike. That being said, let's get back to the video. Now this next video comes from a woman named Morgan Lambert, who while being on a farm in the Appalachian Mountains, captures something pretty spooky on camera. The exact location of this farm is unknown, but Morgan mentions that the property is owned by her family, who've had more than a couple of paranormal experiences on this land. The video starts off with Morgan recording a silly moment with her husband, who came along with her to visit her family's farm. They're here to check the property, as recently strong winds have struck the place. But as she vlogs, something happens that prompts her to stop recording. As Morgan claims, her own voice was heard coming from the distance, beckoning to her husband. Mind you, she was right next to him when this happened. Take a look. Okay. No, you got it. That was such a good pee, bro. A li little red, but it's all good. To make sure no trees fell on it, because we had like 50 mile an hour winds. Well, I was heard my own voice coming from the tree line. Oh hell no! Is this gonna be some skinwalker shit, bro? I decided to film a goofy ass video for you guys to break, but the camera caught the voice that I couldn't hear. It sounds almost just like me. Rewind it? No, no, no. They're gonna play it. We're gonna check it instead of my dad. Oh my god, I'm freezing. Oh, really? Pretty. Oh God. I'm a spell. I said, Oh God. Dude. Uh, I think we're okay. Go. Hey, it's, hey, don't run. Uh, it's okay. We're good. We're good. Um, 
Dude, you know what's obviously so scary? Yeah, it's so obvious that you can, like, record your voice over after and turn it, like, into a, you know, a mimic video, whatever. But what if that shit actually happened? Dude, nobody would fucking believe it. You know what I'm saying? Like, everyone would just think it was a voiceover, but what if you actually did it? Like, that's so... This concept of hearing your own voice is so fucking scary to me. Or like the voice of a family member or like loved one. Like if I heard fucking Tootie's voice downstairs and I knew she wasn't home, I'd freak the fuck out. Like genuinely. It's hard to make out what's being said with all the wind in the background. But if you listen closely, the words baby and hey can be made out. But further adding to the weirdness of this incident is the fact that Morgan didn't hear anything. Based on the footage, her husband was the only one hearing the voice. Yeah, that's weird, bro. That's weird as fuck. All right, number one. Here we go, bro. This last video comes from Edgar V. And in this footage, Edgar is recording a toy mirror that belongs to his daughter. She's been playing with this toy ever since Edgar's neighbor had given it to his family. Oh, hell They've no. had this toy for quite some time. But as of recent, they now think it's best to get rid of it. Why do I, why do I feel like they got rid of it for a reason? You know what I mean? Like, if you take a hand-me-down from some other family, some random thing, there's got to be a reason you're getting rid of that motherfucking thing. Got to be a ghost attached to that shit. And I'm bringing it into my house, and we're going to have a problem after that. Edgar says that just a few nights ago, he was passing by his daughter's room when he heard her talking to the mirror. No. It sounded like she was having a full-blown conversation with someone else. Now, it should be noted that this mirror does actually talk. It would say pre-recorded things like hello or hi i'm the magical mirror. really lane that's this crazy time, bro it was what saying things that didn't seem pre-recorded from odd responses to creepy questions oh. the toy seemed almost alive what is that picture in a short clip edgar and his wife interact with the mirror Hola. Well, why, why do i think there was a soy dora coming after that shit? Oh, God. Dude, that, that's a little ghost girl spirit stuck in that fucking mirror, bro. Now, viewers couldn't help but notice how quickly the toy responds. Yeah, dude. According to some, it seemed a little too fast for an average toy like itself. Some have even pointed out that it shouldn't be speaking as they themselves have this exact toy, but theirs doesn't talk or say anything like Edgar's. What? It's for this reason that the family decided to store the toy inside their shed. Over time, oh, though, Edgar's what? children would come in and mess with the toy. No, that's from weird. From scrapping it to beating it up, a number has been done to this mirror. Because of this, Edgar had to replace some parts, but nevertheless, the toy still works. In this short clip, he shows the toy once again, as viewers want to see if it gives the same responses as last time. But as he films, he gets this. Hola. Why is the answer so quickly? Yeah, we still. No, no tengo fiesta. ¿Tú tienes? No sé. Cuando me levanté, decía a ti. Ay, vas a chingar a tu madre. Just like before, the toy talks back at the right time, as though responding like a real person. Okay. The fact that it also says responses different from before has convinced the family that it's unlike any other toy. They think that it might be cursed or haunted. Yeah, bro. Whatever the case might be. That's what I'm they saying. They don't want to mess with it and think it's best if they keep it away from their home. To this day, the family has yet to know what exactly is going on with this toy. Dude. As always, let me know your thoughts on this one. Yeah, that's insane. So he said the family decided to store it. Dude, 
I'm taking that shit out back, and I'm taking the fucking sledgehammer, and I, dude, I'm breaking that shit into pieces. I do not even care. I'm dead serious. If I found out that toy's not supposed to talk, and other people's toys aren't talking, I mean, I'm, I'm just taking that shit out, bro. I'm taking that shit out. Okay, but what are the chance? What are the chances that that one was maybe like a little bit of a prototype, and they were trying to do like a, a, some kind of voice responsive thing, and he got the prototype somehow? Is that possible? Someone just said I would shit my clit. Okay, well that's gonna do it for uh, the video. Thank, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, dude, so last weekend I was sucking 